now we on the second plane, we're in Charlotte, going to Raleigh, and then I'm gonna get picked up by Cuzzo. Yes, sir. Alright, I'm off the second plane now. I'm in Raleigh. Soon as I got off the plane, instantly just smelled like humid weather, plants, all that. West Coast ain't got none of this shit, you know what I'm saying? with the jangalays, man. Jangalays. <laughs> Big Bojangalays. We done picked up some Bojangles. I asked the lady if I could get a Bojangles shirt. She was like, yeah, let me just, let me call my manager. I'm about to get a Bojangles shirt, you know what I'm saying? Bring that joint to the West Coast and let y'all know what's up. Wow, are you home? You too. Stop playing, man. Merch. Yes, sir. <laughs> Merch. God damn, these prices busting up. God damn. $14 in happiness, I swear to God. So this right here is where Cuzzo used to stay pretty much in this area. Way different from Vegas, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but it's crazy because I used to live here too. And it don't even feel like I did. Man, it smells like elementary school. So we just got back from the mall, or done from the mall. The Antoine bought me a hat. But on the back of it, it say provocative. What? You already know what it is, but it ain't subscribed if you ain't. We back out here in Castle Hain in the country where shit used to go down for real. Dirt bikes in the rain, phone parties, get lost in the cornfield. Man, so many memories lining up all the trampolines, jumping into the pool, dunking in the basketball goal, and getting shocked by the electric fences, petting the horses and shit. <laughs> the dream house. Damn, the cornfield. All types are gone. I'm not even here no more. This right here is where all the memories Smoke my first black and mile over there. Jump in the trampolines, basketball goal, pool in the back. I already touched the pool water. This is where it all happened though. Oh, uh, the gymnastic gym. This is where Aunt Kim work at. We used to go so crazy playing hide and seek, tag. This is where I learned to do backflips. We in here. This is where I used to do all my flips and shit. This is where I started doing flips. This is where I started going crazy. What I do? You know, you're right, you're right, I'll take that. That's the church's chicken my brother took me to. And that's the Taco Bell that he always be flexing about that $12 he spent on me. But for real, don't none of this look familiar. But I don't remember, like I remember this, but like it's all so different. There was so many more buildings last time I was here, but now that I'm here, I guess it was never any buildings here. Oh my God, I forgot about this church being right here. Trey's old elementary school. And then Quay down there. No Quay died, right? 50 Cent. Yeah, no Quay got killed. Wow. Y'all, whoever watching this, this is so wild, man. This is so wild seeing how it's nothing like how I remember it, but it's exactly the same. What the hell? Damn, I'm out here trying to get a video of my old grandparents' house and there's another drug bust when one just happened two weeks ago. And I used to get babysat at this house. This is the house right here behind me where I freaking grew up. This is my Aunt Terry house where it used to be my Aunt Terry house. My Uncle Boogeyman right there. But yeah, this is the house. That's the front door now. They built onto the house. That's the creepy swing set that I used to be on all the time. That's my grandma shed with her sewing stuff, my little bikes in there. Now we about to go inside. Jeez. This is so crazy to see like on the phone. So this right here is the room where my granddad keeps all of his model cars, right? You can see him right here. All of his model cars in this room. Funny story, when I was a kid, I always came in this room because I loved cars. He gave me the love for cars. And this is the one that I tried to steal from him because I really wanted. I think I hid it up under this couch when I was trying to play with it. We got my dad and we got my uncle Boogeyman. We got my grandma, RIP. We got my granddad that's in the living room right now. Cousin Antoine, cousin Mike. This is what this room looks like from this angle. you come up these stairs this is where my room used to be but I'm about to show y'all my dad's old room this is my dad's old room 
This is my dad's sister, my Aunt Terry, AKA Antoine's mom. This is where I found out that I hated basketball because my dad would watch basketball on the TV all the time and give me no attention. This is the room that my sister used to stay in. Still got that paint chipped off the wall. The big ass TV's not here no more. This is what the room looked like from over here. Walk down here. I used to always be terrified of this mirror right here. This is my old room. This is where it all started. My brother's bed. Oh, actually, I think that was my bed. That's my brother's bed. We used to play the game right here. I colored that in hella long ago, hella long ago. Funny story, this thing right here, it's just a little, right? I don't know what it is. I have no idea what's in there. It's cold. Basically, when I was younger, my cousin Antoine would say there was a sock monkey that was in there and he was going to snatch my arm or something if I opened it. So I was always terrified. Never opened up that thing. This rock still here opening the door out of all those years. This light right here. Does it work? Nah. Oh, it does. Oh, my God. This clock still there. Cracker Jack. We got my Uncle Boogeyman, my dad, my Uncle Mike and my aunt terry damn man this is really where i grew up man these beds used to be so big to me now they're so small everything is so small in here my granddaddy his black head used to just be right there we'd be in here playing around goofing off and he'd be just standing right there this the light right here that used to freak us all out <laughs> like walk upstairs on. and you see this drum on everything else pitch black <laughs> <laughs> for those of y'all that know this is where it all went down. I was wanting to record you like talking about the stuff. My phone is dead. Nah, nah, I have to put my makeup and stuff on. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so he was saying that these are all the engines for all the Corvettes that are made. This is the first Corvette. Got collector's hats. From 53. Literally got it. The all. First one made in 53. Got that, that nice leather. Yeah, I always keep it so so to get stay warm. I don't like that. I never could get that stiffness out of it. Oh yeah, for the loosen up that heat yeah. to get on it. Yeah. <laughs> There actually is a bunch of bikes and parts and stuff. And I came right here and I built my first bike. Front wheel was smaller than the back wheel, but you know, your boy got it done. Across the street, this the candy lady. We used to come here and get candy all the time. This is that road. City trains, advanced auto parts. This is the road that we used to know, but it don't look the, this is marketplace. Po po outside, yeah. How you doing there, buddy? Now we out here at my Aunt Terry house. I'm in her yard. This is what the neighborhood looked like. This is her house. I had to get it on camera. An ant hill. Big old fish the tank fish was right tank here. So it's over there now where the fireplace is. Oh, I see. out the cousin's house, Carly and Jaden to the pool. You know what I'm saying? This is what it looked like out here. Has so many memories right here on this porch, right there, this pool at. Right now, I'm in the front yard coming down the stairs. This is where the cornfield used to be that we would get stuck in and lost. I used to pee on that palm tree. My uncle said, yeah, it's healthy for the trees. <laughs> Ain't really nothing to see, but it's a lot to see. Hey man, give me that rich man. Ran quarterback, run the game, killed him niggas, man, I'm telling you. Play any position out there. I'm trying to say. Man, hey, you not fucking with me, man. You're an average player in that boy. You crazy as hell, man. Two wheel, pussy ass. That nigga, he on that good pep. What? Yeah. Sour. How you gonna be better swimming though? I'm telling y'all, my brother like that, man. Backstroke, front stroke. Y'all gotta do all this shit. Y'all done never just saw. You how tall you think my brother is? Oh, 
Yeah, but I came outside and light my ass up. Ah, oh, shit. Oh. Man, you folded that one. You can't go left. You can't go left. Uh, uh. And one. Uh, I got you. I got you. Don't worry about it. I got the angle work, man. Yeah, I think it was... Put it down off the dunk. I want to dunk. Ready? Uh-uh, got unk outside. Man, what you talking about? Let's see a dunk. Hit it. Talk that thing one hand, one hand. I blame for me. And then after Tennessee, I, I don't know where we're going. Yeah, so we got some food. I got a big old burger. He got a cheeseburger. 
Shit, we just chilling right now. You know what's going on, man. Tennessee vibes, man. We outside. Like, actually, you little niggas ain't half of me. Look, I had enough of niggas already. Chill with the bitches, but the niggas ain't feeling. Every time I hit a ceiling, I can't help it if I'm winning. I'm the motherfucking nigga, and the only problem is, look, I'm only getting bigger. I thicker than a nipple. Chop your head off like a barber with the clipper. All right, second day of the road trip. We stay the night at a hotel or Holiday Inn. We at the gas station, get some gas, got some snacks, some orange juice. Good morning, by the way. We out here in. What is it? Little Rock, Little Rock, Arkansas. That's where we at. So we finna head out, man. We was in traffic, right? For like a good 20, maybe 30 minutes. And the car got trying to switch gears. So we on the side of the road waiting, turn the car for a couple minutes. Then we gonna turn it back on, see if we can get down the road. <laughs> hey, yo. Duh, this shit is so tough. <laughs> man down, man. About to put this transmission fluid on. Shit like that, we out here putting the transmission fluid. <laughs> shit, shit dries them up. Ain't no goddamn fluid in this. Damn, it don't fit. Turn it uh top side. Yeah, like that. With a little bit of luck. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, it's gotta start raining now. Alright, that should be it. Get it. Let her sit real quick, let that shit run through. Uh huh. Alright, so we just finna take the car on the block for a little bit, let the transmission run, switch the gears, put it in reverse here and there. You know what I'm saying? Just get that transmission to work that new fluid in. Man, you got a supercharger? Car acting right now. They don't got it to third gear on that street, no problem. Hitting the road. <sighs> All right, y'all. I got some news for y'all. We got to ditch the car. She not running. <laughs> she don't want to drive at all. I don't even know if you gonna make it to OKC. We like 30 miles out still. But we gonna put some more transmission fluid. We only bought two. We gonna put more in there, like two more. Next day, car and blew up and stuff like that. We at the hotel. We getting some breakfast right now at this event maker. We got a little stuff over there and whatnot. I guess we just gonna go to a rental place, get a car, put all the stuff in the new car, have the old car towed to a lot or something, try and get some money for it, and hit the road for like 15 hours straight. We gonna make it today. <laughs> Shit, we is getting us some breakfast right now. I'm about to look at this squeeze of the day, get me some juice. Ooh, we got a special cake. I'm like with some tolerance though. I can't even think of it look like that. All right, so I'm gonna just get me some apple juice, no cap, no kizzy. What the fuck? Oh, I'm tripping. Did it even cook all the way? Shit, we about to find out. God damn, Betsy. Got to sit in there one more time. Man, she looks so nice. She looks so good. Look like nothing wrong. But shit, I guess so. God damn. <laughs> Left the sun roofing over all night, but shit, them lights still. Work. Well, we don't got the Enterprise, whatnot. These all the cars they got. I'm trying to get that one right there. But unfortunately, everything booked. So we got to find another rental place and waste more time. This car. Shit, let me tell y'all something. Betsy here, she's still our friend, but she broke up with us. You know she a saying? dirty bitch. She crazy. <laughs> she a little hoe. Luckily, we, we not in the middle of nowhere. Man. Yeah, man, thank God we like at least at a big city. The we would have got trapped out there in like New Mexico and like the middle of fucking nowhere. No reception. I barely got reception here in OKC. Miles and miles and miles before any type of help. We would have been stuck. We would have been sick. We would have been hitchhiking, no cap. We just came out of Walmart, got us some duffel bags. We gonna 
put the stuff in the bags and get on the plane tonight and fly there. Now nah, we done got the junk yard to come pick up the car. We gonna be out of here, finally. Lower levels. We at the Our airport now. We finna go find some good eats, get this ticket. Right. Lower levels. 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 Thousand seventeen dollars. Cheapest one tomorrow is like two hundred, but it don't leave till six p.m. So that means we got to wait twenty six hours. Oh, that's cool. You know, y'all can just find a place to sit, chill, get something to eat. <laughs> you thought there's only two vending machines down here? We can't get no food until we get past TSA upstairs and on the other side and whatnot. But so we about to get go back to the hotel, get another room, get some good eats, smoke a blunt, and get right. Right outside of Chili's, the workers gave us a lighter. She over there bumping that car on the clock. See, bro, dude. See, we came in outside from smoking. We come back to the table and we got our shit prepared and ready for us. You already know these waitresses is getting a tip. Uh, I don't know what the fuck going on with this floor on the sixth floor. Did this shit smell like straight? Dookie ass turtle sex, bro. Oh my goodness. That drink got to me. Yeah, that drink got to me. God damn, somebody don't have to fuck her shit up. <laughs> yeah, I damn. It's about fancy as a mug in this bitch. Oh, that's the hot tub over there. All right, so last day in the hotel. We got the bags and stuff down there. This is outside, finna go chill till like six five something then hit the airport after that and then we gonna be home tonight at like nine or ten o'clock who knows this is honestly the worst airport i've ever been in they just made us pay like 150 dollars just for two checked bags because we pressed check bags on the computer and then we ended up paying 63 fucking dollars for priority don't nobody give a fuck about that Back out here outside, we got Is Kenan going crazy outside. You already know the deal, mean twine. This finna be the end of the video. If y'all did enjoy this, make sure y'all leave a like and subscribe. Big bike life shit, man. You know what I'm saying? If you wanna eat at Bojangles right here, y'all wanna eat at Bojangles on the East Coast, you better like and subscribe. I'll give you some Bojangles.